Welcome back, everybody. This is Mike with Electric Head TV, and in this episode, we've got another video from Fit for an Autopsy. Let's see how Pandora sticks up. All right, everybody. You know, like the last time, um, what was it? Uh, Far from Heaven, I think it was, was the last video. Um, I didn't care too much for some of the songwriting in it, but uh, Fit for an Autopsy is a band that I was into many years ago, and then they kind of fell off my radar. And now that I'm doing this, I'm figuring I'll give them another chance to see what's going on. So that was the last song. This is Pandora. Let's check it out. All right. Get right into it. Nice riff right off the bat. This thing kind of reminds me of Will Wheaton. That's a really good riff. Like a gallop thing getting down here. I thought we'd love seeing the band as one of my criticisms on uh, Whitechapel's latest videos. And so far, this is sounding more like what I'm used to of uh, Fifth Word Autopsy sound. Not that they have to stay within a certain vein, but I'd like to be able to say, hey, that's definitely that band. Self-reflection. This is kind of like um, like the monkey paw type story. Be careful what you wish for, a little pamper. Give me a pamper's box. I go into Edgar Allan Poe. <laughs> kid comics like Edgar Allan Poe. Yeah. Good call back to that slow part. I 
And then of course it's gonna fade out. <laughs> Nuclear blast. Awesome. Um okay, well this would be the second song that I've heard so far off the new album. I'm not even sure if it's out. I haven't I'm trying to refrain from listening to full collections of things before I review the thing. So that way I didn't hear the song before the video came up. Uh that's my first time hearing it. I haven't listened to it on iTunes or anything. <clears throat> uh so video wise, great production, great special effects. Um, definitely that self-reflection, kind of be careful what you wish for. I mean, that's the whole story of Pandora, right? Opening the box and then not being able to control what happens, uh, once you do, or be careful what you wish for type mentality. Um, very good thematically. Like I said, I like seeing the band in it. That's like kind of one of my complaints about some of the, the videos that I've seen a lot lately. They seem to tend to focus on the singer, um, which kind of takes it more of in a pop vibe for me, I guess, as far as videos go. Um, I feel that the whole band, singer involved and everything, makes the effort. They should all be there. Um, unless you're doing like a film video, then none of them should be there. <laughs> but I, that's me. That's just my old school, maybe, opinion on that. But uh, musically, um, a lot better, yes, than the last song. I, I didn't care so much for the Gojira uh, influenced riff. I kind of liked it at first, and then the more they played it, it wore on, but, um, uh, good to see that was maybe just an inspiration for that song. I don't necessarily want to see every album to sound the same, no, but like I was saying, I'd like to say, okay, even if it is different, I can tell who's playing that song. It's like, um, Deftones. They changed over the years. Um, they're nothing like they were from Adrenaline to what, Gore. Uh, so, but you can still go, eh, that's Deftones playing that song. That's kind of what I'm looking for when I say, uh, that I don't care too much for that type of drastic change. It's kind of, I don't know, I don't want to say off-putting, but if you don't really know the band when you hear it again, it's like, have they gone too far? Uh, but again, that's just my opinion. Um, good breakdowns, man. Good riffs. I like that opening riff kind of just right out the gate, punches hard, ready to go. And then there's a nice little slow calm down spot, takes it back into it, and then NG right on the end, back in that calm, and a little bit of an outro. Very nice, very nice. Um, again, these are all my opinions. Let me know what you thought of the song down below. Um, I appreciate the time that anybody takes to comment, whether you like my opinion or not. I take the opportunity as a nice chance to talk about some music, and we can reach a nice level of discourse and, uh, you know, talk it out, see where um, where we stand, you know. Uh, I'm not really out to change anyone's opinion on anything. I'm, or even denigrate or attack. I'm just out to express my opinion. That's all it is. But, uh, yeah, if you like what you see here, um, and you appreciate what I do on the channel, take the time, go to electricheadrecords.com. Uh, you can do some tax free shopping in the U.S. just in time for Christmas. Uh, visit us and follow us on Instagram at Mike T underscore H E H R. And at electric head underscore records underscore official. Uh, till the next one, y'all stay safe. See you then.